morning everybody Josh Better Homes and Garden Real Estate Paramount I got a late start this morning I really wish I was about 30 minutes ahead right now I've got carpet cleaners meeting me at the house that we're doing the make ready on this morning at 10 a.m. and uh, it's 9 15 right now but I've got to go by tractor supply first and pick up um, some bungee cords and then I want to see if they're having a special on so go to tractor supply real quick grab some bungee cords looking at some drills because I need to change out some new sign panels that I got in and then uh, go into the make ready home ASAP to get the carpet cleaners in. I do have a lockbox on the property. I'd rather not give them the code, but if I do end up giving them the code, I'm just gonna switch it out. I'm just gonna change change the code once they're done. You can't trust anyone nowadays. So you just gotta, gotta look out for yourself. You can't trust anyone. So alright guys, pull in the tractor supply right now. I will see you when I get done and uh, the bungee cords are for the tarp on the Malibu and then the drill of course is for the sides oh man look at all those zero turns not gonna get one of those anytime soon talk to you later guys bye okay I got the tarps I got the uh, um, I got a tarp it's for the dogs, the tarps for the dogs. I'll zip tie theirs down. And then I got 10 bungee cords for the Chevelle, the Malibu. So that'll get that tighter. And now I'm heading there. My GPS says I'm gonna be there at 9.54 a.m. So I'm ahead of schedule. Um, man. It's that time of the year. It has been some long nights. I'll let you guys go. I want to chat with you about, do you have uh, other agents? Like, you're the listing agent. Do you have other agents ever say that the seller's requirements are ridiculous to you? Like, um, I had an agent today, and, and she may be, she may be uh, being so upfront with me because um, we know each other. You know, that could definitely be the case but um, if a seller wow that's a gross looking spider if a seller makes a requirement of something um, as agents it, you know yeah we've got to tell our buyers and whatnot uh, what to do but do you do you ever have an instance where a agent just blatantly says your sellers addendum is ridiculous like like that it always weirds me out when agents say that the, the sellers the ones paying their paycheck why are they telling them that they're ridiculous when they're do, do they do they want to not get paid I guess I mean it just blows my mind when agents say stuff like that about the sellers addendum so uh, just kind of curious your guys thoughts on that if you guys run into that where buyers agents think that they're um, running the show when the sellers the ones selling the property like don't mess the deal up for your buyer just let the buyer know what the sellers conditions are and get the property sold if the buyer chooses not to do that that's fine but but don't put yourself in the transaction it's not your transaction you're a buyer's agent you know open the door let them look at the house and schedule the inspections um, I don't know. I just think it's weird when buyers get mad at sellers. Hokey dokey. I will, uh, and I'm sure I do the same thing. Like with the whole, uh, with the whole TRR issue going on right now that I'm working on right now. Like as a buyer's agent, I'm sure I do the same thing because the sellers in my mind act a little ridiculous. So I, I know I do. I know I do. So, as a listing agent, it weirds me out when I'm on that side of the fence. As a buyer's agent, I guess I understand it. Alright guys, I will see you later. Um, 
gonna go let the carpet cleaners in, gonna go mow, etc. etc. See you soon, bye. Okay, there's a little bit of wind out here, but not not enough to mess with the camera, I don't think. We're gonna be mowing probably about an acre and a half today. Uh, just mowed it last week. It's been raining twice since we last mowed and uh, We're gonna be string trimming all the buildings some tin some buildings um, Around the house stuff like that around the dog yard in the back. So Yeah um, When I get started, I'll do a timer and then when I get done We'll stop the timer and see how long it takes me to mow um, not even going to try to time the string trimming. I think this is probably at least a three hour job with the riding mower that I have and the string trimmer that I have. So uh, luckily got internet at this house. Got to do some business real quick before we get started on this and then, uh, then we'll get started. All right. I'll see you guys on the next clip. wasn't even recording all right this this uh mo job took me about an hour and a half uh no it didn't uh it would have taken me an hour and a half with the right equipment this mo job took me probably about three and a half hours because i had to string trim everything and mo but uh got it all done got the dogs watered gonna feed them gonna go work on that tarp over there on that car and uh, i just uh, swabbed the floors on this house that we're doing the make ready on so i'll see you guys soon okay so I tightened it down a little more. I put uh, eight more additional bungees on it so it's a little more tighter. I've just got to get this place sold so that um, we can get the credit card paid off and uh, get that thing up and running and then we'll sell the Mazda 3. All right, guys. Um, this is the mow job today. At least three and a half hours probably. And uh, that's the tarp. But we'll feed the dogs and go home. All right, I could not tell you guys not tell you guys this before the end of the day. I am. Um, this agent's been telling me for a couple days that I was going to get an offer. Last time they told me that, I, I told them, you know, I'm excited. You know, we've been talking about that. You know, once it gets in, that's that's great. I'm super excited. Well, um, that same agent's been saying that my seller's addendum is ridiculous. Okay, they've been talking, like literally talking trash about my seller's addendum. And today I get the whole contract. I didn't even get the whole contract when it first got sent over. I get the whole contract today and they made modifications to the seller didn't okay you know I get it that that's gonna happen that happens in, in real estate and negotiations that happens one of the modifications was and on the inside I'm laughing I'm like you've been arguing about the sellers addendum for at least three days like you you can't believe what you just told me you, you can't honestly believe what you just told me I don't say anything because you know I my job is to help people get things sold. So I don't say anything to muddy the waters, but I just wanted to let you guys know that some of the some of the responses I get from other people in the industry completely contradict what they've what they've been basing their whole argument on from the get-go. It just it blows my mind when I'm discussing contracts with people and they completely contradict themselves. I just, I don't, it's always funny. So I had another one of those instances where I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, what do you guys say in your industry, in your business? Do 
you deal because I'm in customer service. I deal in real estate, but but it's really customer service. So I'm sure at customer service, you guys put up with a lot of stuff. Any of you customer service guys, you deal with anything where a customer is like blaga 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 blaga, and then out of nowhere, they just completely contradict themselves. Do you ever deal with that? Put it in the comments below if you do. Uh, just funny story I wanted to share with you. It's 6:30. I've been working hard on the make ready house uh, floors are going in next week looking forward to that just can't wait to get that house with the photo shot and get it online and I'm probably gonna get a 360 camera to um, to showcase that house with and probably do a Matterport tour on it also so I'll keep you guys in the loop on it 405-315-7965 if you guys buy or sell some real estate give me a call I'd be happy to help out Josh Barnett Better Homes and Garden Real Estate Paramount Oklahoma's listing agent have a great day guys bye